I do think think that this is um, a, a situation that uh, is affecting uh, uh, the way we can address uh, climate change. Uh, to start with, the fact that, uh, as you mentioned, the um, uh, energy crisis, the food crisis, uh, in general, disruptions in, the, in, in, in value chains everywhere, all of that is creating uh, consequences for the everyday day lives of many people. And um, normally those most affected are the ones that live in the, in the most uh, vulnerable uh, situation. So it is a very difficult um, environment. Uh, when uh, you ask uh, politicians uh, to take decisions, of course, they will normally focus in the immediate um, in the immediate needs and um, this is this is where I think that the focus can can shift from away from climate change even if those issues those very issues like like uh, energy security food security uh, are very much linked to climate change uh, but we we still run the risk the same about the financial support that is so much needed for uh, climate action in developing countries. Um, you know, there are uh, huge amounts of money flowing into, into the war, and uh, at the same time also, in the developed world, um, economic crisis as a result of the consequences of uh, the pandemic. So it, it all creates really um, a situation where uh, elements come together that would will make um, more difficult our accelerated progress, which is what we really need.